and the man in charge of the ring, Ray Kaitom. Let me introduce first the fighter from the blue corner, officially weighing in 111 and 3 port pounds, wearing black with red. Here is John May Akope. And his opponent to my right in the red corner, representing ARQ Boxing Stable. He officially weighing in at 112.4 pounds. Here is Ramel Macado. This is the fourth fight of this afternoon. Jun Jun or Ramel Jun Jun Macado versus John May Akupi. Scheduled for six rounds, 112 pounds. Akope with a one win and zero loss. This will be his second fight. And of course, the former gold medalist, the newest also member of the ARQ Basting Sable, none other than Makado. This will be his professional debut. Pago na naman to? Si Makado? Yep. The f uh, you know, uh, illustrious amateur career to. Gold medalist, former Philippine team. So, we expect so much from this guy. But then again, iba yung professor na kasi din eh. Yes. Sa mga nagtatanong po, kung pwede daw manood, uh, I think this is uh, limited talaga. You know? oh, limited tas, kasi tayo. Si, si Alta Vista, although uh, Cebu City is around uh, level 2 na ata, mm. oh, we're just, you know, 25% lang. Kasi yung facility na to, uh, they're still promoting the social distancing. Yeah, so mga, mga nagtatapo po sa akin dito kung nagsasabi eh. Sir, pwede naman o dyan. Uh, pasensya na po. <laughs> How? Alam mo, as a promoter, alam, gusto ni Sir Jason yan. But, you know, bringing the, the fight closer to the fans. But still, the COVID-19 is still there. So, oh. by invite lang talaga ito yung mga kaibigan, kay mag-anak ng yep. mga boxingero. Eh, kanina nga, yung iba nag-RT-PCR uh, pa. Tayo. Yeah, just like me, yes. Yeah. So, pinaiyak ako ni yan ng nurse, eh. Oh, iiyak ka niyan, eh. Luluha <laughs> ka. <laughs> there is a slight advantage here for Makado, the length and the reach against Akope. Pero Akope also, you know, this is his second uh, professional fight so medyo you could consider there is two fighters uh, medyo rookie pa baguhan pa yes but uh, their coaches are not rookie nakikita ko doon sa kabilang panic from Billy Moore coach yan si ano si Tony Ahas oh so let's see he's also being aggressive right now Good exchange there. Both fighters. Kope. With the blue gloves and Makado on the red one. Oh, good left jab straight there by Makado. And both fighters are very aggressive on the first round. What do you natin? Laban kung laban. Yes. Pasok yun, jab straight. And six rounds na naman ito, no? Puro umabot ng uh, distansya. Will we finally see uh, a knockout? Tignan natin. So, mahirap din kasi we know all the, all the opponents are very kalibri. Yes. Mag magagaling eh. Makato sabi mo, decorated. So, he must have known the uh, Laurente or yung mga sipangka. Oo. Oh, oh. Yeah, yep. the Philippine team. Yes. That's the end. That's how quick the fight is. Both fighters, very quick, energetic, aggressive. That's the end of the first round. Let us see some highlights. This is your Encuentro Cuatro, presented to you by ARQ Sports. He's trying to measure the distance. Mabilis din yung mga reflexes ni Makado eh. Nagkakapaan pa sila masyado. Wala masyado makatama. Kulang 
pa ng konti na lang. Konting adjustment na lang sa distance. Kita mo yun. And good block right there. By Akope. And we're now back. Second round. Schedule of for six. Both fighters, the same trunks, color, color combination. Hindi ka tulad sa basketball, no? Kailangan light and dark magkaroon. Dito ang fight pareho. So, kailangan nyo tingnan sa gloves na lang. Yes. Akope on the blue one. And Makado. Red gloves. Red gloves. Pareho lang yung buhok. Pareho din yung kulay. Halos parehas din yung... Good body. Good body punch there. By Akope. Very disciplined. Still both. Both fighters. Yeah, just looking like a, a very good matchup again. Tatansahan uh, eh. Oh. Tatansahan, distance, and then they, both fighters will exchange at the same time. Hihintayan, sino magkamali. Pero cover na cover eh. Dalawang, dalawang kamay nasa mukha eh. Mm. Good push there by Makado. Bilis din itong Akope na to. John May Akope from Mantikaw City. Uy, ka, ka, ano dyan ni Naabne? Hindi ko Mantikaw din yun eh. Di ba? Si Naabne? Parang. Kasi malapit sa Osamis yun. Maraming nanonood na kayo Mantikaw eh. Hmm. Good exchange there. Both fighters. Napuha oh. na buhay yan. Kaso na-counter. <laughs> Good body there. Bye. Makado. Na-trigger na -trigger si Akope. Talam mo yung minsa kasi pag nasaktan ka, automatic yun eh. Gusto mo gumante. Bumawi. <laughs> It's within the DNA of each fighter. Lalo na pag Pinoy. Lalo na pag Pinoy kahit saan pa, laban. Our referee now trying to separate There's two fighters. Wild punch there by Akope. Oh, good. Job to the body by Akope. Quick hands there to Akope. Huh? Mm -hmm. oh, galing ng mga judges natin tumitindig eh. Gusto makita yung mga angle eh. <laughs> Naka-elevate na yan ah. Oh, Naka-elevate na yan ah. Yun naman talaga dapat no? Uh, The better score. This is why, you know, lagi ko sinasabi, no? The judges, you know, they're trained and yung perspective nila is different. Tsaka wala silang anong instant replay. So, minsan talaga, syempre sa instant replay lang natin makikita, eh. Yung mga cream punches. Oo, minsan ang hihirap, eh. Kaya nga yung mga, minsan yung mga coaches, isigaw kahit hindi natamaan. Oo, style yan, style kasi. Style yan, eh. Oh, good exchange there for both fighters. What a way to end our second round. Let us see some highlights of Makado versus Akobo. A better round, but much more active than in the two boxes that we have. Oh, but you see, you see, you good. Right job there for Makado to end that round. Grab the ano upper cut, dami. na ng mga angle ng camera natin, no? And this is the first time that may nilagay tayo ng microphone sa ring para kasi sa live natin medyo mapaganda. Ah, yes. Saan dami mo camera din dito? Iba-ibang angles talaga. Well, we're trying to improve. We're yeah. trying to improve. Fighters and the productions are improving and I'm, I'm glad to be a part of it. Of course. Every time yan. Matik ka na yan. Wala ka namang kontrata sa amin pero parang always na yan eh. The number one. <laughs> salamat, salamat. Sana hindi na magkakasabay sa bike. Sport YouTuber. <laughs> Ayun yung problema. Ayun lang. <laughs> oh, pero pwede na mag-schedule yan eh. Promoters. Uh, ay, yes, yes. Ang dami. 30 days in a month. And yung, yung gab naman eh. They uh, always suggest naman eh. The dates. 
Ito na, medyo ito talaga, no? sa gitna na round, dito makikita magpapahinga, mm-hmm. trying to rest, kinakount yung mga punches, the movement. This is also the round, sa itong third round, na medyo kahit pa paano, gamay na nila yung isa't isa. They know the styles. And uh, dito dapat yung na-measure na nila yung distansya. Hindi eh. na ito peeling out round. So ito na yung pinaka... yung strategy nila need to come out here. Yeah, kasi mahirap for both team. Mahirap mag-scout eh. Kasi ako, pe, this will be his second professional yes. uh, fight. And for Junjun Makalo, first pa lang eh, professional debut. Yes. So how will you scout? Wala ka ng scout, dito na lang. Going to the body for both boxers. May nagkakagirian na ngayon, ha? You know, I thought, uh, good, it's... Uh, I don't know if it's funny or you know good thing about this uh, f- fighter for ARQ Boxing Stable. Ito si Junjun Makado. Nag-message talaga to mm. sa page ng ARQ sabi ng strength and conditioning coach nila na si Coach Roger Pondot. And he message na sir, can I try out? I wanna be part of the team. Yeah. So it goes to show the the promoter, uh, the the founder of Mr. Jason Arquesala, the support that he's giving his players. Mostly stay in play. Yeah. Not stay in. Kaya talaga, syempre, they're gonna fight to impress as well. At, uh, syempre, nagpresenta sila eh. Makado now. Alam mo, may pressure din eh. Kasi, you yes. know, you, you're a gold medalist. You're a, prof- you're a former Philippine national team. Hindi pwedeng wala kang skills at talent dyan to be a part of that team. Correct. Makado. I like how the way he's using his shoulders. Oh, Pantula. pasok yun. Pasok yun. Yung uh, right hook ni Akope. Pasok yun, ha? Ito na, medyo nagkakaramdaman na ito ng ano. They know the fighting style. Oh, what wild punch there by Makado. Makado goes to the body. He's throwing with bad intention talaga. So, oh. Kitang-kita mo sa mata kasi eh. Yes. That's the end of our third round. Let's see some highlights. Again, this is Encuentro Cuatro. Hey, RG Sports. Thank you. Our counselor, Mr. Joel Garganarov. The head of our IATF. For the support and the... Giving us the clearance to have this, all of our fighters before this fight event, like RTPC are pa rin tayo. Kahit na we're still on a level two, importante pa rin. Social distancing. Okay. Yes. Sabi dito ni Fernando Makado, 2016-2018 Philippine National Games gold medalist. Yon. Pero yung kalaban naman niya, oh, bad boy ng sibuyong coach. Ay t-shirt lang pala yun. Ah, sulat bad boy na si <laughs> Shout out sa kanya. Okay, bad boy. And uh, here we go. Both fighters still very fresh. Credit to the condition of these fighters. We're now in our fourth round. Scheduled for six. Akope now starting. This is the f- first time he's very aggressive right from the bat. Oh, solid. So I can't help myself. <laughs> oh, so lit, so lit. Yan yun. And it looks like he's still trag- struggling here. Napapayaka pa siya. Medyo oh. taste pa to another one. Akope, what a good punch there. Solid na solid yun. Medyo nagkumpiyansa sa doon. Nakalimutan niya itaas yung kamay niya. Oh, Makado, but no, clearly. The legs of Makado still there. Parang kitang-kita mo sa mukha. He felt that one. Yes, at napayakap siya ng maigpit. And ngayon, that is a solid punch. There's only two things that can happen right now. How will Makado react? Yeah, Makado, go- punch? exactly. But Makado, very disciplined, still goes to the body for uh, of Akope. Alam mo, for me, ah, if I'm not mistaken, you can correct me. Ah. Ang, ang kulang sa lahat ng mga professional boxers, alam mo yung close fist fight? Mm. Yung nag- phone booth boxing. Oh, yun, yeah. yun, yung ano. nagkikirian na, yun yung kulang natin eh. The skills there. Uh, sig- siguro, depende rin kasi sa, ano, eh, sa style ng mga gym na yun. Uy! Nakaganti. Oh. Nakaganti doon. Makano <laughs> with that right 
Hook. Baka dito makakita tayo ng down. Pwede. Pwede. Kitang-kita ko sa mukha ni Jacope. He's very tired. With one minute left here on the fourth round. Para nakabawi yung Makado after that earlier. Both of them are tired. And this is what I love about boxing. Para any any time pwedeng magbago at pwedeng matapos. Yeah! Hindi pang hangin. You just lay it on the line. Yan sinasabi ko lagi, nothing against basketball sa basketball, sa fourth quarter, hihintayin mo yung oras matapos. Ito, mamaya, pagka pikit mo, biglang may bumaksak, oh, tapos. Kasi pwede delaying of the game eh. Ah. Pag ikaw, you can delay the time sa basketball. Ito, pag delay mo, eh, pag pikit ka. Maisahan ka, oh, just oh. like that, yung mga counter na ganun. And pareho pang may lakas. Although, this is now, has turned into a battle of attrition. Kung sino mas condition dito, tingnan natin. Oh. Oh, kasi dito na round, both fighters. Natatamaan eh. Clearly solid punches for both fighters. Last 10 seconds. <laughs> Ang hirap is Corion. That's the end <laughs> of the fourth round. Scheduled for six. This is your eight RQ Sports. Encuentro 4. And look at that. That is the right hand. That out of balance talaga dun si Makado, no? And napakapit dun si Makado. I don't know. I haven't watched the amateur fights of Makado. But he got tested right there. Yung uh, panga niya. Lakas din nun. Nakabawi naman to si Makado, eh. Tingnan natin kung makita natin sa replay. Kasi siya rin na nakatama din, eh. Yung patlong besi ulit. Talaga yung out of balance. And this time around... Six to tayo, no? Five. Ladies and gentlemen, testing. Wala. Inatay nila. This is round number five. Round five. Round number five. Wala yung mic ko. Wala. Pinapatay nila. Makado now. And... Akope. Na pareho na katanggap ng solido and the best punch from each other on that fourth round. Ngayon medyo na papay nga. Trying to be very patient with their punches. Mm. Both fighters. Makado now goes to the body. Both fighters want to go to the body. Uh, at this point, no? And, and when both boxer was able to receive punches and able to sustain and, uh, kumbaga, nakatayo pa rin sila. What else can you do? Try to go to the body naman. Tignan mo naman yung katawahan. Oh. Ay, baka hindi kaya niya. Katawan talaga. Boxing. Yung last encuentro, tres, yung knock, knock out punch to the body. Ni Chan Paul Gabonelias against Almasen. Yeah. May mga 2 to 3 seconds na delay yun eh. <laughs> Tsaka napayuko eh. Let's see if they go to the body this time. Oh, good uppercut there for Makado. There you go, the inside fight that you're asking for, the full oh, book. Yun yung gusto ko eh. Yun yung kailangan na kulang tayo, mga Filipino yeah. boxers. Literal na toto-toto at saka head-to-head. Ito mo, nagtotoruhan sila. <laughs> head-to-head pa. <laughs> and the uppercuts are raining body shots. Salamat po sa lahat ng sumusuporta, no? And, and this is Encuentro 4. Presented to you by ARQ Sport Makado versus Akope. We have... Seven fights left in the afternoon. Yes, and the best is yet to come. And the best is yet to come. Our main event of the afternoon. Abne versus Diagon 2. Oof. Oh, good 
right uppercut there by Makado. And at one. And uh, I've been noticing maganda yung uppercut nito ni Makado. Eh. Oh, medyo yung uh, ilong din ni Akopi, dumudugo na din eh. Last 10 seconds, good left jump there for Makado. Konti na lang tong tinatapo ni Akopi. There you go. Bilis din ng referee natin eh. Pasok agad. And that's the end of our fifth round. Let's see some highlights. They try to go inside. And then they uh, request the choke yan, inside with the uppercut. Medyo nakakalamang ng konti dito para sa akin po itong uh, Makado at this round at least. Yep. You can see some blood sa mga mukha nila. Ito yung hinahanap natin. Good fight matches. This is your sixth and final round. This is your sixth and final round. Wala <laughs> talaga. Sixth and final round. At busy yung mga ano natin eh. Pag ano lang ka mo. Ladies and gentlemen, this is your sixth and final round. Makopi now. Three straight uppercut. Hindi lang natamaan si Makado. Oh, fighters changing. Ito yung laban. And uh, at this stage, both fighters need to win both rounds. Pero mukhang mas, medyo mas may hangin itong si Makado ngayon. Oh, Napaload na yun. Napaload na eh. Not from a punch, but uh, from a condition na yun. And Makado is gonna push here. Ayan, mapapayakap na. The referee said, watch for the head. May dugo na rin si Akope. Very brave fighting here. And uh, Makado trying to... Oh, ang galing din ni Akope. Eh. May solid punch lang talaga. Medyo, he's just a bit tired now. You can clearly see him hugging Makado. Makado goes to the body. Ito yung sabi mo, Pawe, the condition will speak for itself. Yeah, th this is again, battle of attrition now. At mukhang mas pagod na itong si Ano. Ayun, pagod na eh. This is gonna go for the body. Makado now oh. goes for the kill. There you go. And that will be a knockout. The first. The first knockout. And the first win for the first professional fight of the former Philippine national team member kitang kita mo dugo yung ilong oh, ni Akope very good pare I was very impressed nakatanggap siya ng isang solid right hand in the earlier rounds and he, he came back he pushed back hanggang sa naubusan yung kalaban niya and therefore winning this by a technical knockout very impressed with this guy you see some highlights here that's twice already he almost fall off pagod na definitely has seen enough oh. and I'm gonna go to the ring to uh, announce the announce. winner <laughs> what a win by Ramel Junjun Makado from your ARQ boxing stable good potential potential here you can clearly see the happiness of Makado showing all over his face and now give you to our ring announcer to announce the official winner. Just. Ladies and gentlemen, the end has come. In the 1 minute and 38 mark of the sixth round, declaring your winner via technical knockout, Ramel Mercado.
That's it, folks. What a way to start the professional career of Ramel Junjun Makado. A knockout, a technical knockout on the sixth and final round. Let's see some highlights here. 112 pounds. Fight match. Our next will be none other than Yeruge Gura versus Giovanni Taguse. Yeruge Gura, one win, zero loss. Giovanni Taguse, six wins, three losses, four wins coming from a knockout and one draw. That will be our next match. We'll be right back here on Alta Vista Encuentro Cuatro presented to you by ARQ Sports. Podcast Sports. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell.